Hello, my name is Delith Morgan and I'm Chief Executive at Breast Cancer Campaign. Many people don't realise, but breast cancer is the most common cancer and that 50,000 women are diagnosed with breast cancer every year and 12,000 women die of the disease. Estimates suggest that by 2025, 57,000 women will be diagnosed with breast cancer every year in the UK. At Breast Cancer Campaign, we're serious about risk and prevention because we know that the best way of overcoming breast cancer is by preventing women getting it in the first place. That's why we're investing £1 million into research to explore the best way to reduce women's risk of breast cancer. My name is Tony Howell. I'm a professor in the University of Manchester and I'm particularly interested in preventing breast cancer. Breast Cancer Campaign have identified both risk, estimation and prevention uh, as a major theme for their research. They have identified several gaps in our knowledge of how to prevent breast cancer. We can do that to some extent at the moment. We can say, for example, a woman has a one in three chance of developing breast cancer, but we do not know whether she is the one who will develop the disease or the two who will not. Once we know a woman's risk, we can discuss with her some ways that she may reduce her risk. If, for example, she is at very high risk, there are drug treatments where we can cut the risk by about half. If she is at any risk, we can use lifestyle change, which would reduce risk by about 30%. The major problem is trying to get these prevention treatments over to women uh, in the population. 20 years ago, we had very little idea how to prevent breast cancer and what women's options are. Now we have a better idea, but there is a lot to do. We already know a lot of ways of preventing breast cancer, but the real problem is, is to get them out there into the real world. We'll be finding new practical ways to help women make the lifestyle changes that will help them reduce their risk of breast cancer. We are also calling for new risk models to be available to help identify those women at increased risk of breast cancer as soon as possible. We aim to quadruple our investment in risk and prevention, research, campaigning and education over the next 10 years to £8.5 million to tackle this critical area.